hey guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing well in today's video i will be going from this to this so if you guys want to see me get ready please keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe so let's hop right in starting off with my primer this is the mac prep and prime one one of my all-time favorites it glides on so easily Using the Revlon foundation and my Inglot foundation, I'm going to apply that all over my face. So I like to use my fingers to apply my foundation. Sometimes I like to use my brush as well, but I find it sits better on my face when I go in with my fingers. For my under eye, I start off with the, my Fenty Beauty foundation in shade 430 and I just put that on my cheek area. This one is more of a muted tone and it blends in really nicely with the lighter shade which I would apply in a second. Using the LA Girl Concealer in Fawn, I'm putting that right under my eyes. I hope to switch to the Bond This Way concealer once I can get my hands on that one. But for now, this is my ride or die concealer. <laughs> Moving on to my NARS foundation, which I have now turned into my contour shade. I find that it's a bit too dark for my face all around, so I apply this to the corner of my nose just to give my nose more definition. Sometimes I also apply it on my contour line but I'm not sure I did that today. Okay so I just blend all that concealer in with the beauty blender, a wet one. <laughs> So I am applying some extra concealer above my lips just for some extra coverage. Time to set it all in place. So I start off with my burning eye powder just to soak up all that extra oil. Then I go in with my Huda Beauty setting powder. This is a favorite. Next, we're going to contour. So I use the face powder from Inglot. I think it's a perfect shade to bronze me up and bring back the warmth. I'm also using my matte powder to dust off the excess of the setting powder. My brows are pretty straightforward as you can see. I use a pencil to just carefully follow the pattern of my brows and then I add some concealer and a brow gel to set it all in place. Okay, so moving on to the eyes. Very simple, I'm just using my Jackie Aino palette. This is the shade Credit. Next, I grab that Ellie Girl concealer again and just do a cut crease, trying to lift it as high as possible to give my eyes a more lifted look. Okay, so I set that with the shade Bay from the Huda Beauty palette. I decided to line my eyes today even though I haven't done that in a while. I've popped on my lashes, that makes a huge difference <laughs> for my lips. This is my spirit lipstick by MAC Cosmetics. 
Now I'm going in with Vixen and Trendsetter by Huda Beauty. These are liquid lipsticks and let me just say, every girl of color needs this combo. It's so good, it's so amazing. So I'm applying the darker shade on the outer corners and Trendsetter on the inner part. Going back in with that contour shade to set my nose contour and then I'm applying my Laura Mercier highlighter in Gilded Honey. I've also applied blush. I just dipped into my Huda Beauty palette and I used the shade Man Eater and Henna as a blusher. It works guys. I know it's eyeshadow but it actually works. Alright, it's time to finish up my hair. It should be dry by now, I hope. <laughs> Apply my Huda Beauty setting spray to finish off the look. And voila! I'm all done. So here's the final look guys. I give myself a little flick out at the bottom and I'm feeling super cute. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one.